April 2020. You know, this has been an interesting ride here for about the last month, and we have to bring these trucks for sale to you right now, or we should bring them to you in our showroom, because everybody is um, pretty hunkered down, staying close to home, but truck sales are still happening. That's why we're doing the video. We're inside today, and this is a ST58, 5,800 gallon five compartment Seneca built tank. This morning we're looking at this T880 and it's equipped with the X15 Cummins 450 horse. This engine this year has been redesigned to a new generation of exhaust emissions. And as you look at this, the simplicity of this engine, you can look at all these accessories and it is not as complicated as some of the engines you're seeing in the past and some of the competitor engines right now. Uh, easier to work on and Cummins uh, philosophy is more of it's done in the SCR now So it kind of reminds me back in my trucking days when I started out just a 350 Cummins. It's real clean uh, We're having a lot of customer uh, Feedback on this engine that the uptime is is very good the extended warranty on this engine to show you how reliable Cummins uh, believes in this engine 60 months five years 300,000 miles engine and the exhaust emissions included $55.75 a month. You know, you look at that for guaranteeing this engine and the exhaust emissions for 60 months, five years for that kind of money. It's definitely something you gotta buy, but compare that to what uh, a used truck in five years or the last 12 months per month has cost you in maintenance. This new T880, uh, the improved dash. Um, a lot of customers haven't had experience with this truck yet because they had the older style T800 Kenworth. And this has been a successful run. All the buyers we've had that have come into this truck have come back with exceptional reviews. The uh, quietness of the cab for the operator is just exceptional for a big truck. Climate control, just uh, all these controls are very much based and operate like a, a SUV automobile. They tell me the cli cli climate control year round is uh, very reliable, very comfortable. And also uh, it's just complete visibility and layout of gauges has been very improved. And with the new uh, built in uh, backup camera, instead of having it remotely uh, on the dash, it's built in now to the dash. This particular truck, uh, as we mentioned on the engine review, 450 horse Cummins. Now it has the uh, automated transmission. In a Seneca tank spec truck, this automated transmission comes to you programmed in a vocational program that we have found that will give the truck a lot better uh, acceleration response than most programming that comes from the factory. This has to be specified and verified that it's done to the truck. If you have a truck you've purchased from us in the past with automated transmission, you should contact your sales representative at Seneca Tank because uh, most of those trucks can be reprogrammed now to improve acceleration and shifting patterns. This T880 is equipped with a dual bank manifold. This also has the bottom load features for terminal load, gravity drop for two products, this is also a good good situation if you ever have to do maintenance because you can drain this manifold without disassembling for uh, purging of the truck. The manifold is all controlled from our air panel in the back. We encourage the loading at the bulk plant or the terminal to for the operator to identify as he loads what the products are in the compartments just for verification for the operator to know what was last hauled and currently hauled in the compartments. This ST5800 pumping system has the high speed pumping system on the curbside. This three inch LC meter is rated 20 to 200 gallon a minute. The high speed portion of this is used through the center hose reel. With the weights and measures legal distribution valve here, it is set right now to pump through the center. To pump through the, the uh, hose reel overhead and then out the, uh, the hose on the curb side would be repositioned and be pointed towards the curb side. Also has our Seneca tank distribution panel that controls the air manifold. There again, setting up the product products as we load and then 
leaving and having the products. If you had number, if you had the unleaded gas in this number five, you would set it when you load and leave the loading facility to the gas side. If you are going to have number four, you're going to have a diesel product, you set it to diesel, and so on, right on down the line. Diesel. Diesel. And diesel. That way, till the truck is unloaded, it's set up, and it's very simple operation. Pull the number five. We're going to go number five. We got unleaded, and it's going to pull it off of the unleaded side, the gas side manifold. 5,800 quad. What we're looking at, the important part for you in a big pay, legal payload is the spacing of the axis. You'll notice the quad axle configuration. When you look at the exterior bridge law from the center of the front axle to the center of the rear axle, this is qualified for 66,000 pounds of total payload exterior bridge legal. I'm Steve Reiswick, this is SJ Reiswick. Thank you for being here in April of 2020 with us today and looking at this Seneca tank product that's for sale. These tanks that you've looked at today are Seneca built and we've been doing this uh, for a long time. It's really um, the craftsmanship, the quality, the operation of the unit is, is far superior and we really appreciate you, SJ. Yeah, thanks, and thanks for taking a look at this. We don't think it's an accident that uh, you're at Seneca Tank. We'd love the opportunity to work with you and uh, show you why we're so excited about this equipment because it really does represent uh, the hard work of, of all 86 of our team members here, and it comes out in the craftsmanship of each and every new Seneca Tank. Thank you. Thank you.